The best place to view storms here is actually in the Point Restaurant at the Wiccaninish Inn, um, where you actually have 270 degrees of view of all of mo what Mother Nature can provide. We built the inn looking, coming over from our cabin during the big storms. My father dragged us kids over. We got to go and check and see how far up the ocean is coming to the point so we know where we can build this building. And I was standing out there and my mind said, I know this is safe, but my heart said, run for higher ground. Because seeing that set of waves coming in 18 feet and coming actually right up under the deck of the restaurant as it does today, it was, you, you just felt that it was actually going to come right in where the windows were going to be. At the Wiccan Inn to, to be able to enjoy the storms, absolutely first and foremost were windows everywhere. Every single guest room and every single public area has a view out to the ocean or the beach. A few other things we added were microphones bringing the sound of the waves into the restaurant on one track and beautiful classical music on the other track. Um, of course, when you want to get out and walk in the, in the storm and get a little wet and get, uh, uh, get a taste of a West Coast facial, um, you, um, you have your rain gear, your boots, and so we also built a, a perfect uh, boot drying uh, closet, so you, you have a boot dryer right there if you uh, happen to get a little wet, you uh, just hang up your rain gear, put your boots on the rack, sit down by the fire and have a latte and everything's dry in 15 minutes. Uh, storm watching I think is, is caught on a lot because, um, and people have enjoyed it and, and, and appreciate it because more and more today we live in such an urban society where, where nature is almost something to be avoided. But out here, it's all about nature and really we, we have a saying, there's no such thing as bad weather, just poor clothing choices.